Hello, and welcome to this lecture on the human reproductive system. Today, we'll explore both the male and female reproductive systems, their main organs, functions, and how hormones control their activities. By the end of this lecture, you'll have a clear understanding of the foundations of human reproduction. Let's get started. The male reproductive system is designed to produce, store, and deliver sperm, the male reproductive cells necessary for fertilization. Let's look at the main organs involved. First, the testes. These are oval-shaped organs that produce sperm and the male hormone, testosterone. Next, the epididymis. This is a tightly coiled tube where sperm mature and are stored until ejaculation. The vas deferens is a long duct that transports sperm from the epididymis to the urethra during ejaculation. The seminal vesicles and prostate gland produce seminal fluid. This fluid nourishes the sperm and helps them move efficiently. Finally, the urethra runs through the penis and serves as the passage for sperm to exit the body. Sperm production is called spermatogenesis, which takes place in the testes. Hormones control this process. FSH, or follicle-stimulating hormone, stimulates sperm production. LH, or luteinizing hormone, triggers testosterone production. Testosterone is responsible for male secondary sexual characteristics, like a deep voice, facial hair, and increased muscle mass. The female reproductive system produces eggs, provides a site for fertilization, supports pregnancy, and allows for childbirth. Let's examine its organs. The ovaries produce eggs and hormones, mainly estrogen and progesterone. The fallopian tubes transport the egg from the ovary to the uterus. Fertilization usually occurs here. The uterus is a thick-walled, pear-shaped organ where the embryo implants and develops into a fetus. The cervix is the lower part of the uterus that opens into the vagina. The vagina serves as the birth canal and the organ for sexual intercourse. The external genitalia, collectively called the vulva, protect the internal organs and assist in reproduction. Oogenesis and hormonal control. Oogenesis is the process of egg development in the ovaries. Hormones play an essential role. FSH stimulates the growth of ovarian follicles. LH triggers ovulation, which is the release of a mature egg. Estrogen and progesterone prepare the uterus for pregnancy and regulate secondary sexual characteristics, such as breast development and body shape. Differences between male and female systems. Here's a quick comparison. The male system continuously produces sperm and delivers it for fertilization. The female system produces a limited number of eggs, undergoes monthly cycles, and nurtures a developing fetus. Both systems rely on hormones to regulate reproduction, growth, and sexual characteristics. The male reproductive system focuses on sperm production and delivery. The female reproductive system produces eggs, supports fertilization, and nurtures the fetus. Hormones are key players in controlling these processes in both sexes.